what happened to all-star games? And I have my thoughts. What can be done to improve them? We, I, we, we have our thoughts, but the, the Eastern Conference All-Stars get the 211 to 186 <laughs> win wow. last night. And I watched a lot more of it probably than most, but I was doing work and doing laundry and, and all that kind of stuff, so I had it on in the background. But Flannel, I don't, I'm not going to bore you with, with the details of the game or break down the game or anything like that. Here's the deal, Flannel. I'm different. I was a little more entertained than most because Dame Lillard is like the <laughs> ultimate exhibition game play. That man was pulling from half court yeah. Yeah. and sending him through. He was. I, yeah. I like that stuff, Flannel. I'm sorry. I do. Well, I think it it speaks to maybe the era of basketball we're in right now where the three-point shot has basically became like the highlight dunk. I mean, you saw that with Dame Lillard pulling up from half court. You saw that with a Tyrese Halliburton just draining three after three after three making the, the – on his home court because the All-Star game was in Indianapolis. I didn't necessarily hate it either. It's just uh, it's just the way that it is. The All-Star game, there's not really any incentive for players to go that hard on defense or, or anything like that. It's just for people to have fun and kind of, for lack of a better term, clown around a little bit. And the reason I say clown around is because you'd never, even for Dame Lillard, tolerate a half-court shot in a regular season NBA game or a playoff NBA game, of course. But... Yeah, I don't necessarily mind it. I I know a lot of people are kind of put off by it, but it's fun. It's not it's not real. It's just an all-star game. We don't need to it doesn't need to be something that's taken too seriously.